Welcome combatants. So we're going to talk about who could be General Shao's actual rival this time around. Is it still going to be Lou or maybe Raiden? But do like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, follow me in the future for more content. So obviously we don't do a lot of General Shao videos here. And General Shao is definitely a good character. I like his power and whatnot, but I don't like how they always treat him when it's not his chapter. But yes, General Shao definitely is a very good um, villain and he's also not the conqueror that he used to be because he's obviously working under Sindel. So a lot of things have definitely changed when it comes to General Shao. But who will his rivalry be with this time round? We obviously know there was a heated rivalry between him and Liu Kang and it seems like that's been stretching for a good eon as he doesn't like Liu Kang to a T. He really hates Liu Kang and that is still the same way. No matter what Liu did, that is still there, that hatred for it. Now there was something shown between him and Raiden, though it's not as strong, it is still definitely there and it shows that possibly something could build, especially after the loss he had from Raiden in this tournament which dishonored Shao Kahn well General Shao. Now they have always hated each other going back through eons. Shao Kahn and Raiden have never got along. They've always had issues and Raiden has always hated the um the antrics and stuff that Shao would do. But now we've come to a new era where instead of them really hating each other it seems like it's more than ever hated for the way how he is with Liu Kang and it seems like he doesn't hate Raiden from back then as he did Liu does Liu Kang now. Now we did see they, them teasing that after all the people he could have gone for, the Shao Titan version did go for Raiden. If not for Raiden's other counterpart, the more Thunder God version from the other realm, he would have definitely made his end, which has made Raiden want to train more so that he could possibly stop someone just like General Shao by seeking refuge and help from the Shirarayu Scorpion. So there is a possibility that we will see something trickle into the future of a rivalry between these two. Will it be something legendary or something really quick we don't know but when it comes to Liu Kang now this is definitely one that I feel like they will still keep hand in hand the same way as it feels that now Liu Kang's gone back to his demigod his normal like lifestyle kind of demigod type route not a full powered god who can't die this is interesting for General Sha as we know these guys have been fighting for years eons these guys have been enemies for years and years and years and it's gone to the point where all of us have grown up knowing Je Shao Kahn versus Liu Kang as the fight of all fights, the villain of all villains, the, the boss of bosses and Liu Kang being the hero of heroes fighting against Shao Kahn. So with these other variations, no matter what timeline they go to, no matter what form of media they go through, Sh Liu Kang versus Shao Kahn is always always a big 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 plot and it's always the main thing to it though in this game it was not teased but who says it will not trickle into the way how the past had deemed itself before man what a legendary picture that is man mk9 what a game but when we go into everything we've seen that somehow Liu Kang is always a thorn in Shao Kahn's side even in the aftermath where he crushed Liu Kang's hand and basically almost killed him you could see that this was all pent up anger for so long of him hating Liu Kang so him moving into this new era and hating Liu Kang it feels like the anger that he has for him because he's known of him for years and Liu Kang has known his ancestors and whatnot he really hates Liu Kang and knowing that Liu Kang kind of shaped everything it makes it even worse as he wants to be that powerful person which brings me to Onaga again even though Onaga is trapped and this time General Shao wasn't the one who did anything to him it was his ancestors it's cool to think that maybe he might take Onaga's powers and maybe take him these powers to make it his own which will rival Liu Kang in powers, giving him that conqueror vibe again, giving Shao Kahn that strong strength that he has. He already has a dominance and a really strong power with the legends and battle tales they tell of him. But what else could he bring forward? Who else is going to be the rivalry or who will be? Will it be Liu Kang people, the chosen one? Will he come through and be the one that fights against Shao Kahn, General Shao when he becomes Shao Kahn? Or will it be Raiden this time around? And Raiden will be the one that seeks to finish off General Shao for good or be the rivalry that we've never knew that we needed or even knew that was going to come or maybe they might save Raiden to be someone else's opponent and you know who I'm talking about there Shinnok but let me know guys who do you think do you think it's going to be Liu Kang do you think it will be Kung, um, Raiden which rivalry seems better but do like subscribe this is your boy Future Boy Adam at the Future stay frosty peeps peace